Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. I want to share this video with you, but um, I'm not really sure if YouTube would approve. You know, I've read the community guidelines. I know you can't say anything that goes against what the FDA, the NIH, and the CDC recommend. Therefore, I'm not really sure if this is an okay video for you or not. I'm just going to put the link in the description box. It is on Brighteon, but it has to do with our dearly departed Rob Skiba and Russ Dizdar, who died within a week or maybe 10 days of each other, and also the near death of Steve Quayle, who talks about what happened to him and his wife. Despite all the things he was taking to prevent getting sick. So I'm just going to leave it up to you. If you want to watch it, great. If you don't want to, that's fine too. But I wanted to do a tribute to, the, to Rob and Russ. But I already took off that video pad from my computer when we re-downloaded Windows, I couldn't figure out how to make that thing work. I tried. I watched the tutorials two, three times, maybe four. And I would drag, click, drag to take out things. And then I'd try to pull in pictures. I'm just, you know, I'm not, I'm technologically challenged. Let's face it, you know, it's not my forte. That's not what I was called to do. Some of these people make beautiful video, videos. They can get a word from the Lord and, and like uh, Saving Lives LLC. He can illustrate, find pictures to make a, a two minute video, three, four minute video into something, you know, great. But me, all I can do is bring you the information, let you click on links and watch it for yourself. That's all I can do. It's really all I have time for. And um, whether you really agreed with anything Steve Quayle said, or Rob Skiba, or Russ Dizdar, they were men of God and are. They may not agree with the way I understand the word of God to be they may not tell it like I do but they tell the truth according to what their sources have told them what the Lord has told them especially Russ and Rob anyway that's all I have to say about that God bless Steve and his wife, she didn't get so sick. Steve ended up in the hospital, did pull through enough to come home on oxygen, and he tells you what he believes is wrong with him. Okay, with that, I'm going to say bye for now. Keep reading Psalm 91. Claim it and believe it. In Jesus' name, bye for now. Talk to you later.